Welcome back, everyone. This may go down as one of the nicest falls in recorded history. It has been great. I'm a fall lover, and this has been even better than uh, usual fall. But now, for those who like the cold and the nasty weather, which I also enjoy, uh, it's on its way. Right now, though, in Milwaukee, it's 66 degrees, still very warm. We did tie the record once again. That'd be the second day in a row that we tied or broke the record. Southwesterly winds are starting to increase. You notice how cloudy it was. We've had some downpours around the area. Things are about to change pretty quickly, though, as we get into the uh, late afternoon to the early evening. The front pushes through sometime around 5 o'clock. Those winds will shift to the northwest, and temperatures will drop by 10 o'clock already in the 30s, and wind chills will be in the 20s with a gusty west to northwest wind. We've had a few downpours, some rumbles of thunder out there from uh, Lake Geneva and Palmyra and through Waukesha County, even northern Milwaukee and Ozaki County uh, over the last hour to hour and a half. All that is kind of quieted down and pushed off to the east. It's all with this huge storm system that we are in the warm sector of the storm system for now. There's your cold front. Temperatures already begin to drop off to the west and heavy snows back uh, into Minnesota where they have winter storm warnings and blizzard warnings for the western and north central part of the state up there. They could see anywhere from 6 to 12 inches of snow, if not more, on top of those very strong winds. We're getting the strong winds as well. They're just starting to get cranked up and they'll continue to increase throughout the late afternoon, the evening tonight. And throughout the day tomorrow, you could easily see gusts of 40 to 45 miles per hour. They're currently between 20 and 30 out toward the Dell, starting to crank up to around 40 miles per hour. So it's going to get windier as the afternoon wears on and into the overnight hours. The wind sh shift is also going to occur probably sometime around 6, 7 o'clock as well. So there are some of those scattered showers later this afternoon as the front pushes through. The colder air will start to move in here and those winds overnight will start to shift to the west and northwest. Yes, we could see some snowflakes flying if you're up early or late tonight into the early morning hours tomorrow. There will be some scattered snow showers around. Could see a dusting of accumulation. Fond du Lac, Sheboygan, northern Dodge counties, but the ground temperatures are so warm. We've been in the 70s the last couple of days that should melt on contact. But yes, there will be some snowflakes around. Then things quickly clear out for the afternoon, but the winds stay gusty throughout the day today. How much snow are we talking about? Up north could pick up one to two inches of snow. It's central part of the state, a half inch to an inch, and then just a dusting here in the southern portion, which quickly melts. But once again, for deer hunting, Hunting. It doesn't look like there's going to be much, if anything at all. But there will be plenty of wind. Watch out for falling branches and trees out there, and temperatures will be cold. You've wanted the colder weather. You got it. Temperatures in the 30s with wind chills in the teens and 20s. But right now, completely different. 60s to almost 70 degrees. Tonight, we're dropping into the 30s with wind chills by morning into the teens. And then tomorrow afternoon, these are your highs. <laughs> Mid to upper 30s with a 45 mile per hour wind. That is not all that pleasant. So here's the forecast. We're looking at 67, 68 today, 38 tomorrow. We'll have those morning flurries and light rain showers. Quickly moves out and clears in the afternoon. The better day is Sunday. It's still breezy and cold, but not as windy. Winds 10 to 15, 42 on Monday. Tuesday, start to see a few rain showers. And the busy travel day on Wednesday looks to be rainy and temperatures in the upper 40s. It's